Good morning, it's match day. Welcome to the Back of the Net match day vlog. My name's Sam. If you've not subscribed, make sure you do and like this video as well. It truly helps. Fingers crossed, it's going to be a win for us today. Look, Bournemouth have got some really challenging fixtures ahead. Man City, Liverpool, Arsenal. Today, we're playing Wolves. They've picked up under their manager, Lopetegui. However, I've got a sneaky feeling about today. I said 2-0 in the preview. I'd go for 4-0. I'd go for 1-0. Whatever happens, we need to turn the L's into D's and the D's into W's. And we've been lacking a W under Gary O'Neill. Can he get his first as permanent manager? Let's get to Molyneux. We're picking up Steve, Tom, Ben and Adam. It's an away day for the lads. Come on, you Reds. Hello, mate. You all right? Yeah, good. You? Yeah, very drive. good. Lovely drive. Went to Warwick Services. Didn't didn't get the usual subway or KFC no. or anything like that. It'd be too early for a KFC anyway. A bit it? too early, and I'm hoping to get some get some food in the pub actually today. But um, yeah, no, nice easy. It feels it's weird because we go to Manchester a lot and up <laughs> north. This feels like a little already halfway, aren't we? It's like the, Midlands, the fine. Drive was was gorgeous, and, and we've parked. And you know when you park and then have to walk a long way to the pub. Yeah. Well, um, there it is. There. That is the blue brick. That is where we're going. And yes. hopefully inside, we'll see a few Cherries fans. Shall we? So. Our own private boardroom in the pub. This is the right time, isn't it? Tom's gone head of the table, why not? Yeah, I've got me out, you know, I've got the rules. <laughs> <laughs> This feels well too civilised. Tom Jordan's even got salad. Tom, are you going to cope with green stuff on your plate? That'll still be there, yeah. <laughs> Tom's waiting for team news. Tom is patiently waiting. Come on. Come on, where's this tweet? What's going on, mate? One change, mate. Uh, one change, it's Tavernier in for Anthony. So I guess he'll go straight on the left-hand side. Um, but yeah, that's the one change. Anthony is on the bench, so he's fit. So it's just a tactical switch. Uh, sub bench is Travers, Fredericks, Mepham, Christie, Rothwell, Vigna, Moore, Semenya and Anthony. So literally, just Anthony for um, Tavernier, mate. So I, I assume Tavernier that I could go on the right and put up with Tara, but I doubt it. Um, so yeah, maybe it's maybe it's to look at them, but it might just be the fact that Tav's back and he, he likes him away from home. So yeah, I'm well, well happy with that mate. So what, three no walks? Oh, uh, yeah, we're gonna win this. Done, Ben. You're right. Yeah, I'm good. Uh, how are you feeling about today, mate? I, I've still got this confidence vibe, mm. a two-nil vibe, but yeah, like it's not raining, it's not cold. This is not what usual days in Wolverhampton are like. Maybe we'll get something. Yeah, I'm, I mean, I, I feel weirdly confident as well. You know, good lineup. I'm liking the front four. I'm confident. Uh, Jay Z against Trio would be interesting, but yeah. you know, it's it's Bournemouth. Anything can happen. You know, it's it, we we, we just got to get behind them because a bit of positivity. Gary O'Neill seems to be speaking more freely, a bit, bit more positive. Yeah, I noticed that from the press conference. Yeah. He, he seemed relaxed, like a man who knows he's got a bit of time to sort it. Carrie's here. Carrie, how are you? Yeah, great, thank you. How are you feeling about today's game? Do you feel do you feel like we can get something? Newcastle was better, wasn't it? Oh, it's amazing. Um, yeah, I really hope that we're gonna carry on that momentum today really positive game against Newcastle thought the team gave it their all I reckon we're going to scrape a win today Hi Sam lovely to bump into you how random was this being oh, no. you on the street um, in Wolverhampton of all places University of Wolverhampton this is where we're passing right now right, get to the point what do you want seeing all the local <laughs> landmarks what do I want I want some insight from you Steve so, in terms of how you feel is it, it could go today? Earlier on in the day, I wasn't very confident. 
I've done a bit of a Tom Jordan today. I've yeah. had a few points and I feel a little bit more confident. However, I still, I, I don't know, I still feel they've got a little bit too much for us. Yeah. We've just got to play our own game. I think, you know, man to man, we could maybe be better than them. Because um, I think people will say, oh yeah, Mateus Cunha, he's a good player, but he's, uh, I've, I, I'll, I'll jinx now and I'll go score two, but um, <laughs> he, he hasn't been great. Um, and I think their defence is really guessable. Mm. And I think, you know, Tavernier against, I, I think, Samedo's at right back. I'm not sure though. Um, yeah, I, I, I think that's going to be a great battle. So, yeah, I'm, I'm looking forward to that. I'm going to say 3 0. They, 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 yeah, they've got the new manager in. They feel like they've turned the corner a little bit. They've got real, real quality. Um, but there's that little inkling of hope that we've got that little bit of quality now with Atara and Traore coming in, a few, you know, Dom coming back. Tav coming back, who apparently is in today, which is good news. So, I've got tent hooks. <laughs> oh, I know. I'm, I still don't know where I am. I'm going to err on the side of positivity, and this is me being positive of one all. Here we are then. We are at Molyneux. Beautiful, beautiful ground, really. I think this club have got a bit of money, and they are looking to redevelop. I've seen some images of what they want to do, but um, as it is, it's still looking. Splendorous. Outdoor tunes here at Molyneux, love it. Probably demonetised after hearing that. <laughs> we are in. We're in. And we're upstairs. The wolves. <laughs> Who would live in a house like this? Superb design top, talk to me about it, looks lovely, doesn't it? Yeah, lovely. Okay. I'm not kidding, when those things light up, I can actually feel it on the side of my head. It's hot, it's hot. Man, it's warm. Camera that one, always on his camera. God, just enjoy the game. Well up, Jay Z. Jay Z, good challenge there on Troy Ore. I tell you what, that's going to be a hell of a match up today. It'll be really interesting to see how him and Tab deal with Troy Ore. Here they go again, though. He's gone round him. Yeah. Jeffy, no, that's not, never a pen. Absolutely bought that, absolutely bought that, and so much so, I would book him. I would book it completely. They're stopping it. They're checking for the VAR. Yeah. There's going to be no way that that'll be given. He's yeah, absolutely they don't ball that. Even, even they wouldn't even leave Roy Ball with him. Oh my God. Neto, Neto again. He's having his moments in games that could severely derail our survival push. It's three in a row that Brighton, Newcastle had today. He's made an error. He's getting away with it at the moment. Um, On the plus side, Barnes are winning Dove. Okay. Not that, not that Tom's thinking about next season already, no. Right then, Tom. Hey, John, a geography quiz. Go on then. Name the flag, right, nearest. Brazil. Yeah, after that. Austria. After that. South Korea. After that. Algeria. After that. But yeah, I can't, I can't see further than that. Uh, Portugal. Oh, well done. Look at you. Can't what. See You're all right at your geography, aren't you? Yeah, it's nothing to do with like World Cups and sticky books back in the day. It's all about geography, it's cool. Yet another 
Wolves corner. Let's see if we can get it out. Oh, Taft! Taft! in there we got players letting each other down all over the place Tavernier just had a, I don't know what happened he had an air shot or whatever um, the breakaway didn't lead to anything Wolves ran away oh, Phil mate. Bill had to foul he, he got a to, yellow card he had to the yellow he had to they were in and that was through Tavernier Tavernier no touch on him I don't know what's going on Neto. oh Neto Neto indecisive there my god Come out and talk that. It's getting really harem scarum now. Wolves are putting it on us. Oh, oh my god, he's got so much space. Oh yeah, another. Oh, I'm getting bored of saying it. Go on, Dom. Go on, Dom. Go on, Dom. Call the ball. Well done, Dom. Really good work from Tom there. Oh fuck me! Didn't even, didn't even. Uh, yeah. Oh my god! A corner that didn't even go on the pitch. It is, but that, that was shocking. That was shocking. Time Chelsea nil, Southampton one. Oh my god. Yes, man. Just, uh, I've just looked at his phone. 16th of the table, lads. 16th? Yeah. Push for Europe. Tom's getting stressed. Oh, what a waste. What an absolute waste. It says it all, doesn't it? Head on, head in hands. Yeah, it's been good second half. It's been good, but I, I didn't. Yeah, I didn't like the last couple of chubs, but yeah. um, hopefully we should be alright because they've got much about. No, they haven't. They haven't really. Had, they haven't had to work, has it? No, we're looking good. Mate.
That'll do, that'll do. Oh my god, 1 minute 35. 90 seconds, Tom, 90 seconds. It's not long, not long. Come on, it's doable. Come on, boys, hold on. We're doing well to be fair, we're doing really well. Any second now, it's got to be any second. Oh my god, what have we got? 10 seconds, 10 seconds. Sun's out, gun's out, what a beautiful day. It's Sunday, I left you hanging on this vlog upload, didn't do an immediate one on Sunday morning, but it's a beautiful day, not least because this is what the league table looks like. AFC Bournemouth are above the dotted line. It's a shame that some of the other results didn't go for us, Saints. Fair play to them getting a win at Chelsea. But we've got to concentrate on us, and that was our first win on the road since Forest. First win for Gary O'Neill, as permanent manager and it wasn't the perfect performance first 45 probably left a lot to be desired some poor decision making at times and we just absorbed pressure at times and we looked a little bit shaky too but there was some steeliness and resilience that came into play in the second half and it was helped by Tavernier getting that goal whether it was off his thigh his hip it doesn't matter right place right time and fair play for Dom Solanke for getting the assist Credit needs to go to our defence. I thought they did really well. Really, really solid showing, actually. And you know what? 
it gives me a bit of hope going into those three fixtures, those unwinnable games against the likes of Man City, Liverpool and Arsenal. Gary O'Neill, I've seen from some of the press conferences and stuff, he's not overly happy. And it's probably right that he's not because it wasn't perfect. That first 45 needed to be improved. It was, but there are still improvements to be made. More shots need to be got away on target because we certainly lacked in that. One shot on target, one goal. And we need to be better and more diligent in our final third. But if we can be steely like that, then it gives us a chance against anyone. And fingers crossed, we get to put a good show next week against Manchester City. If you've enjoyed this match day vlog, then you know what to do. Hit the subscribe button and the like, and we'll see you in the next one.